Conor McGregor or Dustin Poirier? The Diamond or Mystic Mac? Or <laughs> Notorious? Like, who wins this fight? Honestly, honestly, I do not know who wins this fight. I've been back and forth and back and forth with my predictions, you know, like saying Dustin's gonna win, no, Conor's gonna win because this, this, and that. I don't know, honestly. I don't know. It's not a lock. In my opinion, this is a hard fight to call. Um, because this fight is huge, okay? Let's hope it does not get canceled because I am so looking forward to this fight. We have two huge names. Not only that, but it's a rematch. Hello? I feel like Dustin, listen, Dustin the first time around six years ago in 2014, they, I mean, he let his emotions get the better of him. I mean, his emotion, he was emotional. He was like taking the bait that Connor throws and, you know, his opponents, the comments, everything. I mean, in the stare down, if you see it, you could just tell. Um, he made Connor bigger than he needed to be. He needs to go into this fight just looking at Connor as a human being that he just needs to conquer, not as the bully that he wants to bully and that it's a bigger meaning to him and that it's like it's huge and like so much is on the line because you know it's gonna get to him he's gonna like clutter his mind with all that pressure you know so he can't go Dustin Poirier cannot go into a dark place leading up to this fight because maybe the camp is gonna go great the stare downs are gonna go his way and interviews are gonna go his way the media day everything's gonna go great but then when the cage is closed what is he going to do? Is he going to have a flashback and think about that day and what it felt like? That lowness, the feeling that he had, the defeat, hearing Bruce Buffer say Conor McGregor, you know, raising his arm and not, and not Dustin Poirier's arm and like just feeling that lowness. He can't go there, you know, because I feel like Conor, you know, I, th I, I thought that Conor had an edge going into this because He's like, well, I beat you once, I can beat you again, sort of thing, you know? And I feel like, but then again, a lot of times rematches, the underdog or the guy who lost, you know, Dustin Poirier in this case, has the upper hand because they just, you know, like, they not that they want it more, but they're just, they're just, you know, it, they have a loss. And it's just like, sometimes like the underdog just does better. So it's like, it's really, it's a hard fight for me to judge, like, gauge who, who do I think is gonna win you know like a lot of other fights yeah like sometimes they're locks you know like a for instance like a Caitlyn Drukagan versus Valentina like yeah Valentina's gonna win that fight I'm pretty confident <laughs> this fight I don't know I don't know who's gonna win let me know in the comments who you think is gonna win because listen these guys are different people now okay six years ago you know even Mer even Connor you know so different he went he's been through so much but like they're still young guys, but like, they've been through so much. Like Dustin has his daughter now. He has like a new motivation. He has, you know, his mental game is there. He's not, he's not gonna go into this as emotional. Um, but then, you know, Connor too, like Connor, Connor and Dustin, they're kind of similar in a way, if you think about it. Like they're both very big on the mental strength of it, of it, you know, because being MMA fighters, I mean like, so much is physical, of course, you know, their physical skill level and their strength and their dedication and all of that. And I love it, but so much too is also their mental game too, because how much of the success of Conor McGregor would you owe to just his communication? How much of that? Because he walks into a room and he speaks certain words to, the, to their opponents and he's just, he wins the fight even before he, he gets in there with them because he, he makes them defeat themselves it's like self-sabotage you know what i'm saying so like you really have to think about like you know a lot of his success came from that so let me know in the comments what you think about this matchup who you think is going to win the fight and yeah because i i don't know guys i i really cannot choose but let me know in the comments who you think is going to win thanks